Yo, what up, YouTube? We are up in New Jersey for WrestleMania. We are going to give you some predictions on how we think the matches are going to go. And yes, I am Brian, your WWE champion. The heavyweight champion of the world, Sean. The Intercontinental champion, Kenny. And this is We, we Speak, Speak, You Listen. And that's the bottom line because Stone Cold said so. All right, gentlemen. <laughs> There's a 15-card match at this year's WrestleMania that we know of. First one we'll breeze through. Well, we'll breeze through the three that are on the uh, on the uh, uh, pre-show. Are these in order of how they're gonna go? Uh, a general guess. Okay. Uh, that means it's wrong. The cruiserweight championship. I don't know if anybody knows about the cruiserweight championship. Buddy Murphy and Tony Nese. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Who's the champion? Well, Buddy Murphy is, and he's been the champion for a while. Hasn't, oh, he's losing. Hasn't it. lost. He's losing it. All right. Mm, new one. That's in the pre-show, though, right? That's the pre-show. So who the fuck cares about So the I'll say Buddy Murphy, too. So that's two for Buddy. All right. Excuse me. The uh, Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal has... Yeah. Uh, Braun's in it? I think there's like almost 30 people when it officially is going to be starting. But Braun's in it. The SNL guys are in it. Andrade's in it. Uh, Jeff said, and Matt Hardy, probably. I said either Sufa... Su um, Souffles. I mean, oh, Mustafa Ali. Yeah. yeah. Mustafa Ali's in there, too. Or Braun. Okay, he's taking two people, Brian. <laughs> one of the guys from SNL. Also taking two people. I'm going to go with one person, Andrade, hopefully. No. But probably Braun. Doubtful. They, they should build him up. He's a lot better than they're, they're pushing No, him. he's a he's, he's stupid. He's got a manager. He needs to get rid of her. Fuck her. She's hot. Whatever. Whatever. All right, Someone's going to get these hands. It's not going to be her. Uh, <laughs> the women's battle royal, a little more interesting. Naomi's in there. Naomi. Asuka, Mandy Rose, all the Riot Squad. There's a lot of good people in there. So be, <laughs> Kenny's going with Naomi. The entire Riot Squad. Riot I Squad believe they're all in it. Yeah. I thought it was just the two of them. I, I actually think it's gonna be Asuka. That's what they should do. I think it's gonna be a surprise. Hopefully, it's not Lacey Evans because she's never done anything. But and everyone would say either Naomi or Asuka. So I'll go something different. Mandy Rose. All right, so now to the main card. Complete guess on the order, but I'm going to go Miz versus Shane. Falls count anywhere as the first match from SmackDown. Brian, what do you think? After what I saw the Miz did on SmackDown and that surprise falls count anywhere match against the uh, three guys, I can't remember their names because they suck and they first time I've ever seen them. Yeah. Yeah, they don't use them enough either. Yeah. I'm going to go with the Miz. I think it's going to be a great show. I hope they go by us because we are kind of close to the ring off to the side where the ramp is, right? Across from it, but yeah, it's, it's, it's possible. Oh, opposite side of the ramp? Yeah. Oh, okay, you simple see, words. I don't think we're going to be in the mix. But uh, <laughs> I, I, there's a good chance based on a when we're sitting. A hit with a thing of popcorn. Oh, no, based on when we're sitting, there's a good chance it could come our way because they do go that angle a lot. Yeah, that's true. So, uh, but I, I think Miz is going to end up uh, winning it. Can uh, Miz. Yeah, it could go either way, but I think the, they're going to give Miz the win because he's the... Because uh, he's awesome. The fan favorite for now, and then he'll switch back back and forth. He's one of the only guys that could do that easily. Him, yeah. Daniel Bryan, Cena, the certain ones are back like and Daniel forth. Daniel Bryan, he needs to retire. Yeah, that's fine. Wow. He, he did for a little while, he came back. Retired yeah, after he <laughs> loses the Kofi. Oh, so probably the best one-on-one -on -one actual wrestling match in the whole show would be AJ versus Randy Orton. Kenny, what do you think? Why don't you go first, Sean? I'm going AJ Styles. I thought I was going last on all of them. Just like oh, the, did? I, I'm the tiebreaker. Uh, who did you say? So he's going AJ. Ooh, wow. that that's a tough one. I heard that there's a chance Randy Orton may be leaving the WWE. <laughs> he's coming with all these people. No, 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 no. I I only got a list of about ten people. Jesus <laughs> Christ, conspiracy theory. But because because of that, I'll go with AJ. So it makes sense. AJ beats Randy, and Randy ends up going to uh, AEW. Jesus. Breaking news here, folks. Jesus. Right. <laughs> I think AJ's going to win, too, because he's lost a couple other uh, WrestleMania matches. Uh, Bobby Lashley versus, unfortunately, they already announced the Demon's going to be there, Finn Balor, Intercontinental Championship. I'll go first on this one. I think it's going to be a three-minute match. What Demon, the fuck? Demon's going to destroy him. Brian, go ahead. I was going to say Demon, too. <laughs> Demon. Straight across the board again. Yeah. Next, I have down, even though it'll probably be later, Triple H versus Batista. New Hall of Famer, Triple H, part of DX. Brian, what do you think? I, Triple H is 50 years old. <laughs> and Drax is also 50 years old. <laughs> but Drax, Batista, the animal, he's not really in it anymore. He's, got, he's doing his movie thing. He's got that new movie coming out. I, I, think, I think this is being used as an excuse 
for Triple H not to enter the ring. I think something's probably happened where he got some type of injury that prevents him from doing the moves the way he needs to be His done. His career is on the line, supposedly, as well. Yes. So so I'm, I'm going with Batista. And it's no hold bar, so the sledgehammer will be out. I'm people, going for Batista. Stop people will be hitting each other in the balls, prediction. Kenny. Yeah. Uh, I'm going with the animal. <laughs> Both of you for Batista? Yeah. All right, 10 bucks. I'm going to go Triple H. Okay. <laughs> the next match, well, the, these two together are kind of interesting because I believe Cena will be involved in one of them. The first one would be either Rey Mysterio versus Samoa Joe, <laughs> U.S. title, and Brian kills the water. <laughs> <clears throat> I'll go first again. I think Ray's hurt, like a fish. and I think Cena is gonna call uh, answer the open challenge. Stop KO from answering it. I think he'll answer the open challenge. He'll beat Samoa Joe for the U.S. title. Cena goes over in New York. Right. I've heard that Mysterio was injured on SmackDown. There was a special uh, art article that came out during the show where they announced that he was injured and wouldn't be able to. They haven't said match. officially, but it's day, right. day to day. Yeah. So I, I don't know. If if he'll what the deal is there, who Samoa Joe's actually gonna wrestle? But I'm I, I don't think he's gonna hold the title regardless of who it is. So he loses either way. Either way, he loses. All right, okay. Um, whatever you said, you said it right. Cena. Yeah. <laughs> but Samoa Joe is like it's the first time he's made a champion. They could take it away quick, and then he just has a rivalry with somebody back and forth, or he could hold this for a long time. This is like a decisive night for that. But the other match that possibly Cena or KO or Undertaker, who the hell knows? Somebody else could be involved in. Kurt Angle versus Corbin. Angle's last match. They made Corbin look great this week. There'd be no way Corbin wins this. Either Angle destroys him or somebody else takes his spot. I'll say Corbin stays in the match. Three-minute match as well. Angle wins. Brian? Kurt's final match. I, I don't see that and letting him go out on a loss. Yeah. He's An going to win. Angle lock. Angle lock. <laughs> Angle. Next is one of the more interesting uh, matches, the SmackDown Tag Team Titles. I'm so uh, excited for that. Usos, The Bar, Shinsuke and Rusev, and Ricochet and Aleister Black. Uh, Kenny, what do you think? Usos. Usos retain. Yes. So Naomi's happy. That's all that matters. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Brian? So I, I know I've said this already, and you guys are making a joke of it, but I did, in that same article, they speculated that the o Uso brothers may be leaving WWE. <laughs> <laughs> um, but whether that rumor tr is true or not doesn't matter for my pick because I truly believe that Ricochet and Aleister Black are going to take it. I agree with that. Usos aren't going to leave, but they'll win it. Usos are going to go to Raw, possibly, because they've been on SmackDown for years. But um, So then in that case, they'd have to lose the SmackDown titles. It sets up a new team, Ricochet and Aleister Black, to take over SmackDown. True. Next, Women's Tag Team Championships. So excited. Brian's pick, Boston Hug. Versus the Iconics versus uh, Beth and Natalia. Natalia almost got ran over tonight by a psycho. And then really? uh, Naya and Tamina. Uh, those are the four teams there, Brian. <laughs> oh, I think I think uh, the Boss Hug connection is going to maintain. Kenny. Boss Hug. I think they're building the Iconics for something. I don't know why. They. they don't That's know. the rivalry that they want to have. There's no way Beth Phoenix wins. I don't think anyway Naya wins. They've already lost three times. If anybody beats them, it'll be the Iconics. I'll still say Boston Hug, probably, but those would be the two that could possibly win. I hope not. I hate the Iconics. They're freaking annoying. The one's hot, though. The other one's kind of, like, manly, but... But they're uh, annoying. <laughs> four left, the four big ones. Roman versus Drew is first. Kenny? Roman. All right. Roman's been getting his ass whooped <laughs> since he's got back. <laughs> I, I think he needs a redemption-type win, I think this and I think this it. is going to be it. Yeah. But I think it's going to be a fucking... Just good old fashioned brawl. Will down. either Seth? Well, I don't probably not Seth because Seth has his own thing later. But do you think e um, um, Dean, Dean, Amber. or possibly Seth would interfere in this? It's uh, no. I think there's a good chance to help Roman. No, possibly maybe, Dean maybe, because maybe Dean beat him. Dean. He beat Dean down twice. Maybe Dean. There's a chance. I wouldn't rule that out. Maybe. I think if he actually shows up, then he's gonna end up but staying. I, mean, I think. Uh, but if he actually is leaving, there's no reason for him to. I heard. I heard Dean Ambrose and his wife. Are gonna be leaving for eight. Well, she's not that great of an announcer, so that's fine. Jesus she's Christ. good in the back. She's not good on TV. What back are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> she makes the guys happy in the back. Oh, no, no, she I does the you. interviews and she's good. All right, but um, well, on the on the ring, not so much. I, uh, she's I'm actually... gonna go with Drew because I think Roman. Um, You're a dick. No, 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 not because I'm mad at. Him. I, I think he's doing well. They're gonna build him up to have a, probably take the t the title from whoever the champion is. 
I think he's going to end up on SmackDown probably and be fighting whoever wins there in the near future SummerSlam, split him and Seth up. So I think he loses this to build up Drew. Drew fights either Seth or Brock, and um, that would be either the SummerSlam or the uh, tables, ladders, and chairs, or whatever, the money in the bank, whatever's next. Uh, I legit don't know how you're standing. Universal title. A, after tonight, you won't be. Seth versus Brock. Brian? Um, or Kenny. <laughs> <laughs> Heavyweight title. I think, I think it's going to be Seth, and I think Dean's going to interfere. You know? mm. That's a very interesting assessment there, Brian. <laughs> what do you think, Kenny? <laughs> I think it's gonna be dope. I think it's gonna be dope. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm going with uh, Seth. I, I don't like Brock. I hope he loses. Fuck him. If he doesn't lose this time, then it's they're just letting him do whatever. Because it made kind of made sense keeping him the champion when Roman was sick. Now Roman's back. He's gonna be barely on TV at all, like he usually is. Take the title away. Build up Seth versus Drew or Seth versus Roman if you wanna do that. But that's more, I think, next WrestleMania. I think we're going to see Seth. Seth wins this. Down. So what should be, the, the eh, I would say probably the funnest match, even though the women's match is going to be good too. But Kofi versus Daniel Bryan. I'll go first on this. I hope Kofi wins. Some people say he's speculating that he'll win Tuesday or he'll win the next match. That he'll get screwed somehow here. But I think they're going to put him over and Kofi finally wins the championship. Bryan? I think it's happening tonight or tomorrow. Yeah, no. Tonight. Later today. Later today. <laughs> I think it's happening on Sunday. Kofi Mania. WWE champion. And he'll bring that belt back and burn that uh, plant, that, 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 plant one. That, that is an ugly freaking belt. You're grinding oh. up. <laughs> SOS. <laughs> SOS. <sighs> Kenny. Kenny. Kofi. Okay, straight across the board. Mm -hmm. Okay, the last match, of course, women's title... But there's a bonus pick in this. How does the match end? Like, who pins who, or is it a tap out? Who wants to go first? I'll leave it to the. I think uh, Kenny should go first. Becky. Okay, how does she win? Becky's gonna end up. Ronda's gonna be out of the ring somehow, knocked out, whatever. And then I think she's gonna finally catch Charlotte in the ring and just give her the business and do what she gotta do. So pin, ta pin tap, or tap out or pin? I think. It, eh. It can be, you know, I think it can be tap out and it's going to be real close for Ronda getting back in the ring trying to stop it. Mm. Like real close. And then trying like, to pull her off. Trying to pull her off and just, you know. I can see that. Good. And then that way Ronda says you still haven't beat me. Yeah. Yeah. Gets a uh, shot for just to get the, her title She back. the belt. Because the rumor is she might be leaving, not to go somewhere else, but to either have a baby or just take a break. Yeah. So if that happens, it makes sense. A year from now she can come back and say, I never lost. You know, and just automatically go right to the top of the list. That's true. Because then you keep the belt for Charlotte because she technically... But in the next year, they got to, like, build up Sasha. They got to build back up Asuka. Naomi should get chances. Because you remember... What... If Alexa's okay, then she should get, like, people that can actually she wrestle. She might not be returning either. Shut the hell up and don't break my heart, please. It's your turn to pick a... Uh, yeah, what? Pick yet. Are you going last? Yeah, I'll go last. Okay, fine. I'm the best. <laughs> the... I would love to see Ronda tap would be my favorite prediction, but I'll I'll say that uh, that would be an insult. <laughs> I'll say it would be a three count and um, Ronda will be knocked out somehow, like her head into the corner or something. So she won't be involved at all, like kind of like what Kenny said, but she'll be like out cold on the side, and then uh, Charlotte will uh, get pinned to three three count by Becky. I think Ronda's gonna do what she said she was gonna do, and she's gonna make them both tap at the same time. I don't know how. I've been thinking about it. I can't figure it out. <laughs> it's gonna be intriguing. So I can't. So I'm going I'm waiting to see it. But I think I think that that she's gonna hum, somehow make them both tap at the same time. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Like the well, video. Hold on, hold on, time out. Time share out. it. No, before we get to that, let's let's talk about this hat right here. Oh my god. Kenny, talk about it, man. That hat. That that. You. That's going old school logo before they became WWE. The World Wildlife Foundation. <laughs> Custom right there. Throwback. Yeah. Sunday. Sunday. <laughs> Cost him 58 bucks. 58 bucks? Hmm. <laughs> no, it was 25 and 25. The <laughs> you spent a lot of money, dude. <laughs> no, I didn't. But it's sharp. It was worth it. Hmm. All right, so this is going on long enough. Uh, <laughs> like the video, subscribe, follow us on 
Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, everything will be underneath. And uh, watch tomorrow some hopefully live videos or semi-live, depending on the connection, from WrestleMania, from the seats, introductions, they let you take it down. matches.